So here we are at the fly fishing shop in Welch's, Oregon with uh, Dave and Mike and we're examining the new Echo 3 spay rods. There's three models in, in the set. There's a 6127, there's a 7130, and there's a 8134 models which are all exactly the right sizes here for the fishing we do in the Pacific Northwest. So what do you think of the looks of those rods there, Dave? Well, Mark, I think the first thing I, I see in these new upper rods is that they've done a really nice job on the, on the color and the wraps on these rods. They're a real nice rod to look at aesthetically. Um, looks like they've done a really nice job with the, with the cork handles on them. They fit real nice in your hands, feels really good. And uh, all in all, just from first, first looks of them, they're a real pretty looking rod. So I know you're, uh, you're trying to bogart that rod for yourself, but why don't you pass it over there to Mike and you know, give him a chance to wiggle that thing a little bit. And you know, what, what's, your, uh, what's your impression there, Mike? I like the cork a lot. Smaller, nice for the average size hand, good position on the ball. I do like the color combination there. It's earthy, and I like earthy. Yeah. Um, it is a really impressive looking system. The feel. Bends right down into the cork, you doesn't it? You feel it all automatically, just bottom handing it alone. Yeah, just a feel to the top, no problem. I think it's going to be a superior head system rod, unquestionably. I'm sure it's going to do it all, though. Now these two good old boys here, they spend a lot of time on the water and they've sold a lot of spay lines to a lot of happy customers. You know, they know how to match them up. So anytime you need a, a new Echo 3, talk to either Dave or Mike, they'll help you out.